the trace of Canada's most successful immigrants study. Recently, the Statistics Canada released their report Immigration Financial Factors and the earnings of principal applicants. The report was an update of the 2015 investigation that helped guide development of a press entries comprehensive ranking system. The main way that skilled foreign workers are accessed by immigration, refugees, and citizenship Canada. Analyzing the 2005 and 2015 immigration cohorts, the study looked at what characteristics and of applicants were the most predictive of the earning in Canada for the short, medium, and long term. The primary traits mirrored at the landing were years of pre-landing Canadian worker experience, ability in official languages, age younger, older, and education. Uh, According to the study, the main factors that impacted the short-term earning of immigrants included pre-landing Canadian work experience, which was the strongest predator of earning in the first one or two years of immigration every year of Canadian work experience, educated to a 18.4% increase in earnings language ability, those who had a mother tongue other than French or English, heard 29% less than those who had either French or English as mother tongue, and education showing those who had received a bachelor's degree earned 12 to 24% more in the short term. Per the results of the study, medium-term earnings were impacted by pre-landing Canadian work experience, still the strongest predator of earning five plus years after landing. Every one year of Canadian work experience equated to a 52 to 59 percent increase in earnings. Uh, language ability and those with an official language as their mother tongue earned 42% more age, which had a strong, which had a stronger correlation to earning than in the short term. And education with the bachelor degree graduates earning 14 to 21% more. According to the study, long-term earnings for immigrants were influenced by pre-landing Canadian work experience even after a decade remaining the most in impactful factor weakened to a 45% increase for every one year of Canadian work experience. Age and landing revealing that younger immigrants earned 44% more than older ones even 10 or 2 11 years after landing, official language ability which reduced earnings of those less profit proficient in official languages by 35% and education which yielded a stronger effect a 23% increase in earnings for those with a bachelor degree. To some rise, as the years in Canada increased for immigrants, the negative effects of age and landing increased. The positive effects of education and landing increased. And the positive effects of official language ability and pre-landing Canadian work experience gradually decreased. There was also another variable that statistics Canada Married and landing for immigrants in the cohort pre landing earnings. When considered into the analysis, pre landing earnings accounted for more impact on short, medium, and long term earnings than any other 
variable considered in the study. It was by far the most predictive feature of immigrant earnings success across the board. The study comes to the conclusion that this may be down to the fence and the pre-landing earnings were associated with a number of factors, including education, pre-landing work experience, and language ability. The study further suggests that it may be the equality of pre-landing work experience that appears to be the most predictive factor in an immigrant's earning in the short, medium, and long term. This study is an update of the study published in 2015 that serves, served as the initial te technical guide to the comprehensive ranking system. The ranking system that IRCC uses when assessing economic candidates for immigration though its price entry. Thus, candidates looking to apply through an entry uh, through express entry system, our programs, Federal Skilled Trades Program and the Canadian Experience Class, should understand the results of this study and the weighting that it gives to certain immigrant trades. CRS factors were also covered in this study and updates in the CRS weighting given to these factors may follow a nice this study has illuminated skilled worker candidates eligible for express entry may also apply to the provisional provisional nominee program the pnp is another economic immigration program varying province and uh, terror Tourists are able to nominate skilled workers for immigration to their provinces, allowing them to arrive and settle in Canada as a permanent residents. Receiving a provisional nomination can also help with express entry success through the enhanced provisional nomination, giving candidates a additional 600 CRS points and virtually guaranteeing an invitation to apply.